If you need someone who can get the job done, no matter the obstacles, you need a foundryman. If you need someone willing to get up at dawn, work all day in the heat and the cold, come home, eat dinner, then go to town and stay past midnight at a PTA meeting, you need a foundryman. If you need somebody with arms strong enough to turn the Earth's elements into machines that power skyscrapers and wind turbines and hospitals and subway cars, someone brave enough to stand in the midst of fire and transform molten metal into hard iron, yet gentle enough to cradle his own child and then grandchild, you need a foundryman. If you need someone with the courage to remain steadfast as jobs disappear to faraway places and people question America's greatness and its place in the world, someone who will walk proudly into the local bank to cash his hard-earned checks with dirty hands and soiled clothing, knowing he's doing more than his fair share to keep America alive, you need a foundryman. If you need someone who wakes up every day with the same sense of purpose and loyalty and pride. Someone who knows without being told that the work he does is important, that by simply doing what he has always done that he is showing his friends, his family, his community, and the world. That it's not what you say that matters, but how you live your life. You need a foundryman. If you need someone who understands that the measure of a man is not when times are easy and your cup full, but when your back is aching and your heart heavy with worry for what the future might hold, someone who will give his all when the going is as tough as it gets, not for applause or money or any reward, but simply because that's who he is. Someone who knows what it means when his son says, he wants to spend his life doing what dad does. You need a foundryman.